the long story short, a friend of mine and I were just 12, you know, we were fooling around in uh, an abandoned body shop. Fire got out of hand and the, basically the building exploded and I caught some of it. I think Damon's, what did he say? He said, you know, there's going to be a tattoo there that people are going to look at and they're going to go, wow, look at that, that's unbelievable. Being in the Navy, I got exposed to a lot of tattoos. Before that, I thought a tattoo was like a faded anchor or something. And it never, I never connected that with art. Uh, and definitely not with transformation. With this particular tattoo, it's, it's basically, there's no design ahead of time. It's uh, Damon's creative mind, and the, the canvas is kind of clear, and he goes. There's, there's a little bit of nervousness, but uh, also there's a calm that, you know, I know he's the right guy. The approach that I take with a tattoo, it's a very much an energetic experience. The way I work at it is me and the person getting the tattoo, the recipient, we are creating the tattoo. I find what makes the magic happen is that we let ourselves relax and with the atmosphere that I create in the room to be conducive to this is to let go of anything that kind of sandbags us down into solid reality, kind of a meditative type approach and allow our, the deeper parts of ourselves, you might, some people might want to call it the soul, uh, to connect. I remember him talking about the experience between him and I, and I remember him talking about the tattooing as it was a life experience almost. Usually people come for a tattoo, in my case anyways, come to me for a tattoo because a shift is happening. And the tattoo is a great way to just tip the scales if they're on a precipice of change.